This is Illinois Radio with Biko, Illinois Jones, and Pretty Riot going down right now. We got a prime time. Knock them out. Get your girl. <laughs> Make your money. Need bossed up. <laughs> <laughs> Shouty. West side. In the building. Talk to him, Richie West. Yo, 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 Richie in the building. Yo, what's going on, man? Man, I'm chilling, man. It's a beautiful day, man. I'm feeling good, man. Good vibes, man. Nah. Twin them. Twin them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I see you, man. It's it's a summertime shot, man. We here, dog. Yeah, man. I'm I finally see, here. See you putting in a lot of work, man. Long time I, coming. Long time. I remember when I first got the mixtape. The first one. Man. It was this. You been turned ever since. You ain't been slowing down, dog. Oh, you can't man. You got to man. You gotta keep going. So how's everything been going, man? Oh uh, man, you know it have its ups and downs, you know. But it's all about seeing it through, and that's you know that's what F two about, you know. F two. Yeah, man. Because you took a little break. Yeah, you did. Took a little break. You know mm-hmm. what was the reason for the little break? I mean. I mean, I I, uh, I had a kid. You feel oh, me? Congratulations, for a minute, you know congratulations. Like, so, boy or girl? A boy. Oh, okay. boy. His birthday was last week. I just had his uh, first birthday party last week. Hey, okay. Happy now. birthday. Hit me. Hit me. <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday to you, too, girl. You know, yeah, your yeah, birthday, yeah, too. It was, yeah, it was my birthday. <laughs> <laughs> you know, the grown-up party started after the little kid's party over with. <laughs> look, look, he, look, he was late to his own party. Like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with it. But, no, nah, for the most part, it, it was really that. I had, um, I had, uh... I had focused on that, and then it was like, you know, I had hit like hit like hit like a little roadblock in like my sound and what I really wanted to go with it, cause it was like, man, like I knew what was calling me, you know, I knew the sound that was calling me, so I, I had a project done at that time uh, before I uh, I just I had just chopped it, I just like just, I scrapped it. So mm. can, I, can I get all little songs? Yeah, man, I got you, bro. I need all of them. Just yeah, give me yeah, all of them. I know what yeah, to do with yeah. them, you know. So, so you saying like what, your confidence went down, or was it just? No, it, it wasn't even anything with the confidence. It was just like th- this, not the best me, you know. Like I, mm. I really feel like if I if I if I really gonna put my best foot forward in this, I want it to be real and, and want it to be really authentic and and give a perspective from my eyes with a project and not try to you know what I'm saying. Chase this lane or chase that. It ain't about chasing the lane. It's you know about carving out your own lane. That's that's, that's factual. That's the that's actual facts. talk to him. <laughs> 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 so so you, you know you came back and you came back like a hundred miles per hour For though. Real. You feel me? You've been running. Then you linked up with some more happy <laughs> hitters, guys like Joel Q and Breeze, Breeze. The Shipmates, Law. Like how how is like. Like what? That just came out of nowhere, dog. I just woke up and saw a video on Instagram. It really was a like, I won't say it like it came out of nowhere because like it, it it just happened. Something that had just happened, but it was, it was like it was like long overdue since it happened, though. Um, you know, like the universe only worked one way, and like that's why I said you just trust your process. I had no idea I was gonna ever even link up with them. Me and Breeze, uh, me and Breeze, we went to SIU together or whatever, but we knew each other from that. But not really on the on the. We hadn't worked with each other or nothing like like musically or nothing. And, um, it just like we just kept running to each other like just you know like when you're on the grind you keep seeing the same people if you on the same thing we kept running to each other then eventually you know like man we gotta you know we gotta link up we link up and the chemistry was just there automatically and then it just built up from there. I met I met Joel through Breeze uh, at a at Breeze video shoot. What shoot was that? Uh, 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 don't quote me. Uh, it's the. Uh, it's the uh, to get right. the money, uh, oh, get the money right. Get the money right. Yeah, yeah, that's, there you go, yeah, money right. I got my money right, money right. Yeah, that's my joint. <laughs> Yeah, that, hey, that joint is bananas. Like, um, when I first heard it, I was like, okay, this this one of them classy, classic bangers right here is. It was smooth, uh, you know. Shit makes they stay mm-hmm. coming through with some of the. I think actually, I think that's when I first got hip to um, Breeze as well. Yeah, off that song. So it's crazy. That was yeah. your first time, you know, me yeah, Joel. Yeah, Breeze, uh, Breeze had just hit me up. He sent me something like, yo, man, we're shooting a video for this joint, man. I got to, like, you know how, how people, we, we started doing the videos, like, kind of, like, with a little storyline. Mm-hmm. He, he was to pay them for uh, yep. the storyline. So we was just welcoming him, bro, home from jail or something like that. Uh, we was just all out there on the block greeting him. Bro gave him the whip, you know. And then that was my first time meeting him at that video shoot. 
And then we, you know, I, you, you just link up with somebody. Yeah. Then I kept seeing him man, well, after that. We just like, <laughs> then me and him, you know, so like, then you just, just start seeing each other in rotation like that. And, and, and y'all created three kings. For real. Y'all. That's what I call them. Y'all. Man. Y'all. 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 Like, <laughs> how, did, uh, how did three kings come about? Um, well, we was all at Bree's crib one night. Uh, but like we was just getting getting our own beats. It, it just it just happened like that. Like I, you know, I will come a little earlier than uh, Joel will probably get there like a little later. And, um, Breeze would just cook up cook up beats for us, or whatever. So we was there. We just having a conversation. Um, it was um, I want to say it was Jay Z. The original uh, Three Kings was on uh, on Jay Z birthday. It was uh, I wonder. Don't quote me. It was December fourth. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, yeah, like that's when we um, that's like Breeze had made the beat. Breeze had, had uh, played the sample, or whatever. Like, man, Moses was feeling the sample, so I was like, man, chop it up quick. He he whip it up. Uh, typical Joel, he had his verse done. <laughs> By the time the beat was done, Joel verse done already. He, he ready. So you know, Breeze had to finish mixing the beat. Then he wrote his verse. Then we recorded it. But um, something had happened with that file, so then we ended up recording again at uh, Joel's session. And that's why on this version of the song, he say it's Black Panther uh, weekend, because that was, uh, that was mm. Black Panther weekend. Yeah, we it was. It. it was. But, you know, so that was like, that's just a little fun fact on Three Kings, how yeah. they came together. Okay. You're going to get that here. <laughs> <laughs> no way else. No way else. Now, you know, you re- we, we recently premiered about... We, we premiered a lot of your joints this week, you know, leading up to F2. And, um, you know, we started things off with Scared, with Joel Q. Um, and, I, you know, listening to the joint, I felt like, you know, you were, you were speaking on just letting people know you don't got to be scared to go go get what you want. Mm-hmm. But y'all put in the emphasis of you scared. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Because like it's like on the, in this journey, man, you kind of walking blind. Cause you creating the light, you know what I'm saying? Like you, like you as far as you take yourself. So it's like the further, further you go, you never been here before. So it's like, man, what, what, you, about what do I do? Yeah, yeah. You know, that's so, dope. Yeah. I ain't never thought about it. Yeah. Like listen like to that. it. That's, and it's crazy when we be coming up with these. Like we really be sitting and talking about like what we about to do with the song. Like it's like it's really like we really just sit. Like before we did Three Kings, we just was talking just about like life or whatever. Uh, Joel, you know me and Breeze, I went to college together. We was talking about that. And uh, Joel was just, you know, geeking. He went to DePaul for like a year. And, uh, he was hollering us about that. And then that's how the verses came. Like, it's like we brought you in three different worlds. Mm. Man. Then we shot the video like that. That sound like Avengers. Y'all finna make y'all want <laughs> <a> movie. <laughs> that's y'all what I say. The, they, got, they got Marvel going on over there. They got the Look. soul stole. They got, <laughs> I need to come over there. You know what I mean? But, well, not to take y'all back to that, but I just wanted to, you know. <laughs> now, um, what I was going to ask you uh, about, you know, F2. And and pretty much F one. So, what's the synonym for the fame? Okay, break that down for everybody so they can fully understand the so, title. So, my first project was called Fame, and it was it was it was never like meant to be. You know, like like I'm 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 saying like this is about fame or being famous. It was like a mentality, I, you know, that I still got to this day about how I move. You know, throughout my journey, uh, it was just you figure it out. You figure out whatever it is that you're good at or what you, or what you want to do, then you go through a process of attaining it. And then once you attain it, attain it, you establish a, a foundation in it that puts you in a position to do other things, which makes it multiply. And then once you do that, eventually you could do whatever else it was you ever wanted to do. That's everything. So it was like, you know, figure it out, attain it, multiply it. That's everything. Mm. So I like the that. That's a nice little formula. So, <laughs> and, and, and just for marketing purposes, you know, it, 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 it's just, that's why I just shortened it for the next, for the next go around because, you know, people who caught it from the beginning, they know, you know, they know what I really mean by it. And then I could always get asked. And I could, you know, yeah, break it down. Yeah, break it down. So that's why it's F two. You know, it's still essentially fame too. But yeah. you know, I just shortened it. I, I, I like it. You know, I like F two. Yeah. I like the famous sound of it. Yeah. But F one was a classic. <laughs> look, 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 that joint is hard. It made me want to be from out west so bad. Well, hey, I am from out west. So, so you, you know, lucky. So you get to listen to that every day and feel good. <laughs> oh, speaking of West out, you know, what made you take the T off the last off of you know West? Uh, cause. Well, my name, my name is Wesley. So, like, my, my government name is Wesley. So, it was like, I'm from the west side and my name Wesley. So, it was like, I could go either way. But, you know, just to, you know, just to have my own little spin on it or whatever, it was just Richie West. Mm. 
Got you. Because you know? I'm looking like, you know, because when you, because we know where you're from the West Side, you know. Um, and just looking at that, I'm like, okay, what a T. <laughs> but mm-hmm. I but I understood it. I'm like, okay, Richie West. So, you know, for those that didn't know. And then, you know, you got Kanye West. And, ah, you know, yeah. You know, all, you know <clears throat> I really want to. Yeah, that, that'll all. mess up the Google search. <laughs> <laughs> so what we going to do real quick, we're going to actually get into a quick uh, joint. And then we're going to come right back with the homie Richie West. We're going to play that, uh, that neat, the talk right here on Illinois, man. Don't go nowhere. We got some good conversation coming up. And, uh. Oh, yeah. Make sure y'all grab tickets to the Logan Show on May 26th. Those tickets are available right now. Go to Illinois.co backslash tickets. Grab those tickets. And, uh, yeah, let's turn up Memorial Day weekend. Here's uh, the talk by Neek right here on Illinois. Yeah. I don't really do too much talking. I let my mood speak for itself. Yeah. I don't really do the talking, I just go and state the facts If I want it, then it's mine, ain't no worries after that I don't even do the race, I just go and do the dash Take a knee and think I'm mad, then get back to the cash I, Now with the talk, yeah, now with the flaws, yeah All of my bras, yeah, come with no flaws, yeah Okay, so I know you got like three different alter egos, right? <laughs> so who who should we expect to hear from on the uh, on F two? Uh, this this is my um, you know, this, I feel like this 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 really just me. Like this is really just me on this project. Yeah, like this 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 really me. This everything that you'll get from me. I want to know what some of the things you learned from between F one and F two. Uh, just don't overthink it. You know what I'm saying? Like you, you know, the, like I said, the universe only work one way. You know, you, you put your effort, you put your, you just make it the best you can make it, and then just let the rest do, you know, do do what it do. And that's what I learned. You know, I used to always overthink stuff. Like, you no, know, I gotta drop this way, or I gotta do this, or I gotta do that to make it, you know, look like this or look like that. And it's just like, man, let the music speak for itself. Right. Because I remember you told me one time, F one was to let people know that you can really rap. You know what I mean? That's why you had all like all the little free. You had freestyles on there, like yeah. I had all the interludes. No, yeah. and now with F two, that's all I did. I just I just took that same concept of, of like the method, the mindset, and I just you know I I feel like I polished it. I even said on the intro track, you know, stepped it up, acknowledged it. Okay. You know, I Man. polished it. You know, like I, you know. You speak wisdom. Yeah, for real. You know? <laughs> like speak wisdom. And, and I got a, I got a skit on there uh, with actually from my you know I, I I got a lot I got a lot of stuff passed down to me like through just you know word of mouth from my grandma, my grandparents, you know my parents. I I come from a big family, so you know I guess all that I'm a soulful dude. I guess. So you know on F two uh, for those that that don't know you and this their first time ever playing a record. What what record would you tell them to pr- to play first that you know you feel will make them listen to the whole project? Uh, I mean it's lit, man. You just press play, you know. <laughs> it, it gets you from the jump, like it, it gets you from the jump. But, um, my joints on there, like I, you know, I got some joints on there, man. Uh, F it, you know, I can, you know, I ain't gonna curse. I got a song called F it. That's that's lit. That's turn if you wanted to turn people, and you know you're looking for that. Um, now if you're just trying to you know saying vibe chill. Uh, karma, you know, it's, it's a bunch of joints on that man. Just press play on that joint. Had go star, had go star too, bro, man. Like it's pressure, it, it, yeah. It's, it's so it's many. A vibe, man. It's a vibe, man. It, it, it's so many, so many joints on on, on F two. Um, I'm rocking with it. The production from the shipmates to DJ L. Yeah. Uh, man, yeah. Like speaking, speaking of production, um, you know what? What made you lean more towards the shipmates and uh and DJ L? And uh, uh, who what was the other guy yeah, named? Uh, Jilla Jilla Yikes Yikes. There we go, Jilla Yikes. Mm-hmm. What what made you lean, you know, st- strategically towards uh those those uh producers? I mean, uh, like, well, the you know, breeze was like when I when I got with shipmates or whatever. That was like you know, I don't know. That's just that's what happened. Like that was right. So that's where all that production came from. It, it's just like man, that, that those that those beats brought out. I feel like my best music. You know, uh. Me and L, we go back. Like, it's another, it's the SIU thing. Uh, me and him with the SIU together. I've been working with him since I first started rapping. Like, I've been getting beats from L. And Jilla, Jilla, these people I've been working with. I got production, other than shipmates, um, I got production from both of them on my first project, too. Uh, Jilla did Ain't My Fault on there. Uh, um, L did a couple joints. Like, 
Yeah, you showed that's that's why I brought it up because I, I noticed you know you you just you stick to your core. Yeah, cause cause I, I you know what I'm saying I feel like I go for a certain like I'm sonically. If you listen, really listen to my project sonically, everything flow together sonically, and the songs flow into each other right too. And I, I was really conscious of that. That's why I, I picked certain beats and I, I whatever one like I wanted it to flow. I wanted it to be like water. Honestly, <laughs> that's the way he grabbed the L. Yeah. Though <laughs> <laughs> he went to go get that motherfucker. Yeah. Yeah. I'm finna go get it. <laughs> he definitely did. That too. For real man, it's, it's, it's dope, man. I wouldn't even, you know. <laughs> Um, so, you know, we're going to actually get into a quick game um, So people can get to know you a little bit more Then we're going to get into your single star, my brother Okay, okay We're going to actually play pressure right after that, too So, uh, first things first I'm going to start it off easy Fresh Prince of Martin Man, Martin, man, come on, man <laughs> <laughs> Okay, uh, you know, I got to take this one from my homie Jones You know, oh, yeah. Avengers just came out So if you could be a superhero, who would you be? Um, or if you had, if you could choose a superpower, what would it be? Uh, I don't know. I, I, I used to like Ice Man. I guess we gonna say superpower. If you if you oh, had a superpower, if I had a superpower, I don't know. I, I hope I could, wish I could fly or something. <laughs> <laughs> Man, what do you do? Like, I don't know. Oh, I like this, give me everybody superpower. Super, yeah, if I got my power, I just wanna. I would be, Glad I got powers. <laughs> I be lit like, oh, I got powers. You know? Am I the only person with powers? <laughs> what kind of is that the question? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna say this. So, uh, what well, say? Hey, I got superpowers. I know. Only, only one that can do this. Only one that can do this. Only one that can do this. Yeah, it'll be lit. It'll, it'll be lit. You know what I'm saying? Like, man. Do. No, he's grateful for his power. That's what they got, you know. What's okay. what's one word that best describe you? Ambitious. Mm. That was quick. I like that. Yeah. I like that. Okay, so pancakes or waffles? I'm about to see what type of person you really are. Pancakes. Oh, I fucks with it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what's a quote that you live by? Because I know you'd be dropping gems, so drop one on us. Um, uh, I mean. I, oh, well, if I could say, I, I would give you a line from one of my songs, uh, like like Star. I said, um, "Ain't no handouts. I don't believe in that. I can't feed nobody nothing if I ain't need it." Mm. That's facts. Almost said, man, drop a freestyle of this, but <laughs> keep going. Man, on the real, I swear, I almost said, keep going. <laughs> uh, but man, you know, I just, I, you know, I, I really live by my music too. Like everything I'm saying in my song, that, that's why I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I wouldn't rap about nothing to try to steer nobody into doing something that I wouldn't do. You know, so practice what you preach. Exactly. exactly. That's real. It's okay. Free game on this album, man. <laughs> F two, man. Okay, so it's the year twenty forty two. Where you see yourself? What you doing? Oh, uh, twenty forty two, man. I'm gonna still be in the game some some, <laughs> some way, some way, form, or fashion. Like you know, cause I I just got a passion for music, and I, I I'm I'm infatuated with the business side of music too. Like, I people that run like various businesses or uh, they end the things like, like uh, with the, within the scene. You know, I try to soak up game, man. I uh, you know, I just this I, I don't know. I, I occupy my, as much time as possible in this and what I'm doing. I can see you. That's I can right. see you sitting in a chair like an executive mm-hmm. in a you know big office overseeing the city view. I can see that because it's and it's like I, I and me personally, I feel like it's effed up that it ain't no major uh, record company in Chicago yet. It's like because we influenced the entire Everybody. the entire landscape of the, of the music industry right now is based off Chicago culture. For real, yeah. Right. Yeah. But I'm I'm you know what? Now we got to talk because. Uh, I say this, you know, I'm saying this to say this. That don't make sense. Anyway, you're right. But the thing about Chicago artists that create a platform, for instance, Kanye is an example, they don't utilize their platform to keep it here. Mm -hmm. They take it somewhere else. But good music is not really a record label, though, either. It is. It is, but... No, it, it is because it's it's under Def Jam, yeah, yeah. Right. and it's it's an actual lineup. They got a squad, so it it is a record label, and you see they have distribution mm-hmm. and they got the sources. So it's it's a label, but it's a branch of another label. Right, but to me, it's like 
it's no artist on his label that he just put on on. True. Everybody's out. Well, like, 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 like when big, I said like Big Shine, when I said major record label here, I'm talking like Def Jam. Like, that, like I'm talking about they like located here, here. in Chicago, yeah. Illinois. That's like to think, think about being a rapper in Chicago and you know Def Jam right, right on, up the street. on Jackson and Clark or something. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's yeah. Def Jam. You like gonna be out there rapping every you day. Know, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like just think about being just know you that can't opportunity. Catch a train. To like niggas like cats in New York or yeah, cats man. in Atlanta could just go up the street. LA, or, they can just like, you know what I mean? Just drop your demo off or just go. Yeah, I, and I'll tell you, mix it. And it's like York. Chicago, the culture right now. Like, how how no company here? Like, how y'all not? It's, it'll be it'll be so much more talent exposed. You know, you know what I think? It's a lot of third that, parties I'm, I'm, here. You know what I think? But that's what we gotta do. Like marketing companies and advertising companies, we should force our music upon them that, that does the commercials and the stuff like that. You know what I mean? And that way, we gonna get hurt. Just Just a little gym out there for all the artists out there. You know, find these marketing companies that does most of it. An advertising company that's in charge of the Mickey D's commercials, the Gatorade commercials that's here in Chicago. Mm -hmm. And that's doing advertising and promotion for them. When you find them, and they doing the shows like the Red Bulls joints that's popping off, get in tune with them. They gonna help you out if you you know what I mean? Sure gotcha. Yeah. Brandon. That's true. Write well, some jingles, cuz. Or we could really just start our own label. Yeah. Just, if we support, yeah, you, if we support know, each other. If, it, if somebody kick it off and everybody just support yeah, it, support. it, it'll grow. Look, the thing know? is, too, when you sign somebody, they can be like, yo, so how much you gonna give me? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Niggas be signing for free, cuz. Yeah. You got any que- any uh, game questions for him, Jones? Uh, I got some game questions. Uh, do you wear your ones with socks or no socks? It, it depends on the weather. Like if I got on shorts, summertime. Or, summertime. Yeah. If it's summertime, I, if I got on shorts or something, I might not wear no socks. Okay, but cool. but, I, but I do wear socks though. I don't know <laughs> <laughs> I'm, just I'm like one of one of them dudes that be like, yeah, you got socks on today. No, no, no. Sometimes, sometimes you look at your ones like, nah, I don't do that. They ain't gonna look right with the socks. Sure, that's like it's some real low ankle ankle joints. But it depends on how you rock them. You feel me? They gotta be lows though. You can't have the uh, you can't have no <laughs> mid tops on yeah, without know, socks. Is, you got mid tops. Put socks on, bro. Look, look. <laughs> Niggas <laughs> be wearing the mid socks, bro. Nah, bro. Niggas, look, New York be wearing the mid nah, socks. Nah, they tripping. <laughs> Y'all tripping out there. In hey, New they, York. Wear, they wear Tims in the summer. So. Okay. So, uh, no, 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 no. You, 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 it's okay to wear Tims in the summer yes, from where, where I'm from. Everywhere. I think that's all in the city. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, what's a uh, poor broke? I mean, it's a poor, poor, <laughs> poor, de- poor, poor and happy or rich and depressed? Man, I, 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 don't, I just don't see how somebody could be rich and depressed. <laughs> So you gonna rich and depressed? Oh yeah, I'm going rich and depressed. <laughs> okay. I just don't. I just don't see how somebody can be rich and. De- you're right. Like, how you got all this money and you uh, sad? What's what's a song? What's a what's a what's a song that you like out? That's out right now. That's not yours. Uh. uh I'm 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 bumping that joy. Uh, the uh, Joel Q man. Uh, I, I, I was about to say it, but I, it ain't even released. It. Yeah, it ain't, it ain't even released yet. But you know, so I'm about to some unreleased Joel Q, man. It's hot, man. Joel Q and Kid Breeze. Yeah, I was just talking to Joel yesterday. He told me he got some stuff. He told us. Yeah, I was look. I was off it. I don't remember nobody else being in the room at the time. I think we were. I felt like it was just me and him in the in the room by ourselves. And the artist was performing. We, we were just, just in our own, look, we we in our own, own world. Look, shout out, shout out to Blue. I'm, I'm rocking with that P2, man. That Panamera P, man. Yeah. P- Shout out P. P. Yeah, that, that, that yeah P.R. Oh, yeah, yeah. He went hand with that. Yeah, that joint crazy. I've been listening to that and that Drew Jilla joint. Drew oh, Jilla yeah. project go crazy too. And shout out to AMG Fresh. I like AMG Fresh too. He shout got some. Out. He got some nice. He got some nice. Now you know. Let let time. let the people know where they can find you. Uh, you know, give out your social media, website, uh, any upcoming events and things of that nature. Uh, I mean, I'm gonna be at the. Uh, I'm gonna be at the Wire May 26. With my oh, people yeah. supporting my people. It's a movie. Oh, yeah. Get y'all tickets, man. Get y'all tickets, man. Uh, my website. That's that's really where everything is at. My website. I'm, I'm I'm I try to stay active with my website. Keep it updated as far as I drop stuff. My project is on my website. Uh, it's richieshq.com. R I C H I E W E S H Q dot com. And all my social media. Everything is Richie West. R I C H I E W E S. You know. F two. Out now. Uh, you can stream that bad boy on everywhere. Everywhere. Head to Illinois.co. Um, it's right there. We premiered that joint. Go to our IG. Mm-hmm. Hit the link in the bio right now on at Illinois underscore view the star video um, for those that are tuned in and following us. And uh, you know what? We finna get into star right now. Yeah. Bye. 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 Bye.
Think about it, think about it day and night to my hair. Think about it day and night. Uh. Think about it day and night to my hair. I gotta get it, so I'm putting in the leg work. Nobody gave me shit, I went in here first. Cause the one that did it early got the bread first. Ain't no handouts, I don't believe in that. I can't feed it.